Well, it happened. Just like I knew it would. It wasn't even an hour into school, and those jerks were causing problems. I mean, just the sooner they are gone from Crimson Valley, the better. That is, if we ever get rid of them. <sighs> oh, man. Oh, man, I just want to lay in bed. It's raining. Uh, but I can't miss any school. Uh, but I just don't want to go to school. I mean, it's not the rain. It's, it's Josh and Mikey. I don't know if I can take that crap again today. I mean, what they did to Seth, I mean... Oh, what they did to Seth was awful. I mean, I should have been expelled for that or at least gotten some sort of detention or suspension or something. Man, this is ridiculous. I'm going to give him another chance like I did you, Bert. Principal Ethan, this is completely different. Oh, well, let's get downstairs. I know this whole situation stinks, but what doesn't stink is breakfast, which most likely means Mom's home. And there she is. Oh, yes, I am very hungry. Well, hey, Mom. Sorry about uh, not getting in until late last night. I was hanging out with some of the guys. And one of the nights, I actually get home at a semi-decent time. I even made dinner. Oh, I know, Mom, and I'm I'm sorry. If it, if it makes you feel any better, I had some leftovers when I got home. We were trying to figure out what, what exactly to do about Josh and Mikey. Oh, I forgot about those two. Any issues out of them yet? Yeah, yeah, we had an issue. They uh, beat up Seth when Mikey called his girlfriend Anne fat. Those brats. I hate you have to relive any of the hell that was White Wind, son. I, I really am. I just... I can take it, Mom, you know. I just... I hate the good people of Crimson Valley have to deal with these two idiots. I was trying to do good when I closed that school. Mom, I, I didn't mean anything by what I said yesterday. I, I think it came out all wrong. I, I knew you were, you know, doing it for good. And at least it's not all of White Wind at Crimson Valley. I, I think we can take these two. Well, if they lay even a finger on you, <laughs> I'll have them buried under the gel. <laughs> okay. Okay, Mom. Well... To cheer you up, how would you and Sarah like to go visit your dad and brother this Friday? You mean visit visit White Wind? Oh yeah, definitely. That, heck yeah, that would that would be amazing. Just make sure Sarah's parents are okay with it, and we'll hit the road as soon as school lets out. <laughs> yeah, no, can do, Mom. Well. <laughs> I guess I should get going to school. Okay. Be careful and make sure to eat your breakfast. Well, as always, you don't have to worry about me not eating my breakfast, but all right. I love you. Uh, try to not get wet. It looks like it's going to be raining a while. and Maybe, maybe we should invest in some umbrellas, yeah? Because I don't think we own any. I'm pretty sure we don't own any, but I'm going to get going. Love you, Mom. Oh, nice. It's going to be nice to see Dad and Austin again. I do love a rainy day, though, but I would prefer to be in bed than going to school. But I need to get to school, and I need to try not to get too wet on the way. Now, I've been told if you run, you get wetter than walking. But I, I think I'm going to take a run this time. We're just going to sprint to school. Okay, three, two... One. Huh. Oh god, that's some cold rain. Jeez. Oh man, this must be a cold front coming in. Huh. Gotta dodge the dodge the rain. Huh. Huh. Okay, we're oh, almost there. All right, we've made it past John's house. Huh. Okay, here comes April's. Oh god, that's all oh, right in my eye. Jeez. Okay. All right, just almost there. And okay. Whoo. Gotta shake it off. Okay. All right. Let's go find Sarah. I bet everybody's a little wet today. Okay, there's Sarah. What, what the heck is Mikey doing? Oh, come on, Mikey. Just 
Leave Seth alone. Uh, hey, babe. Yeah, you, you saw it too, didn't you, huh? Yeah, uh, I saw it. I really hate those two. Well, mainly I, I, I hate Mikey. Why just Mikey? The big one's the one that bet up Seth. Well, I mean, Mikey's the command giver. Josh just, you know, he does whatever Mikey says. I still hate them both. And it's been a train wreck because of this whole situation. Well, you see, I, I hate Mikey because he's just evil, all right? He's the one that, you know, makes Josh do these things. Josh does these things because, well, he's just dumb. I mean, something has to be done. I mean, this, this is just getting crazy. First, Seth gets beaten up, and I mean, who's going to be the next one? It looks like Seth again. I mean, they came into the school and act like they own it. They've only been here two days. All right. I'm, I'm going to go talk to him. I'll see you in class. Jeez. All right, Mikey, stop. What, what are you doing? And who the hell are you? I, I'm, I'm Bert. And why are you still doing this weird dance thing towards Seth? Is it supposed to be intimidation? I'll do what I want, Bert. Wait a minute. Bert. Oh, I remember you. Always getting into people's businesses. Like right now. Get lost, Squirt. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I get it, Bert. Squirt. They, they rhyme. It's just kind of ironic a guy who wears a hat to feel tall is calling me Squirt. What'd you just say to me? Well, I, I, I guess I called you short. Say that to my face. I dare you. All right, fine. I will. You're short. All right, Seth, come on. Let's get to class. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. What did what, what, you say, Seth? Well, as much as I appreciate you sticking up for me, I mean, you, you know you basically signed yourself up for the next beating. No, I know, Seth. I'd rather it be me than anyone else. But you don't understand. I mean, that guy punches. I mean, he punches, like, really hard. No, I, I know he does. I remember the black eye like it was yesterday. You shouldn't have to sacrifice yourself, though. I mean, that's just crazy. Well, I mean, there's no turning back now, bud. He'll punch me a few times and bye-bye jerks. I don't know. I, I just got a bad feeling about this, bud. A real bad feeling. It should be fine, Seth. Don't worry. It'll be fine. I hope.